So we got the Cincinnati Bengals versus the Buffalo Bills. The winner of this game will meet us. We'll get the chance to play the and get beat by the Chiefs. So who's going to win this game? So stay tuned. Uh, shout out to the sponsor of this video, E-Win Racing. So look, nothing for me is better than watching the Cowboys lose. But why not watch the Cowboys lose sitting comfortably? E-Win Racing just sent me this chair. This chair right here, this this game of chair, man. E-Win Racing game of chair. The lie, I've bought like two to three chairs. None of them are better than this one right here. This is like... This is one of them high quality gaming chairs. Comfortable, all of that. Heavy duty, this is a heavy duty chair. I'm like 220. Chair hold me just fine. It can hold up to 550. If you're 550, you're still good. You're barely good, but you're still good. 550, man. So most of y'all should be able to sit in this chair with no problems. One of my favorite features about this chair is how big the size is compared to the other chairs. So the other game of chairs that I had, they were a lot, they were a lot smaller than this one. This one is a lot bigger, but a lot more comfortable. This is like the throne of gaming chairs. I'm telling you, man. So check this for the arm, for the armrest. Look at the color, all black, Batman, all black Batman type. You know what I'm saying? All black like Batman, color clean. They got all different type of colors as well. Me. I wanted this all black, but it's all black went clean. You can't even lie to me. You gotta look at this. Hold up. Y'all gotta look at this. You could boy, I could lay down and watch the Cowboys lose. Imagine going down watching the Cowboys lose, man. What's better than that? I'm telling you, man. Compared to them other chairs, I have some other chairs. Oh, this is a good gaming chair. It will weak. Got another one. Oh, this is supposed to be better than gaming chair. It will weak com to compared to this one? It was super weak. So y'all know I'm only here to give y'all the best deal. That's what I'm doing from now on. If you see a sponsor, it's legit. So look, put OAWD in the code, get 20% off. That's what we doing for y'all, man. That's what I'm doing for y'all. OAWD, 20% off like that. Keep it a buck. This game of chair is legit, man. Now back to the video. All right, so we got the Bengals and the Bills. And look, I've been saying this whole season, I want this going to be a revenge season. This is going to be a revenge season. I, I didn't think we were going to get first. I thought we were going to get second. I said, shoot, we can beat up. We'll beat the Dolphins first round. Get them first round. Revenge on Tyreek. Beat Bills. That's not really revenge because we always beat the Bills. But then come to sense, like, we play Cincinnati and beat up on the Bengals, or vice versa, or we get it, it could have been flipped. We play the Bengals, beat up on the Bengals, and then the Bills. I wanted this to be revenge, so we finna see who comes out on top in this one. Well, I kind of know. I already know what uh, what type of time it is. I already know what type of time it is. And first down as Burrow steps up and throws it complete to Tyler Boyd. Dog. And just like that, Cincinnati finds its side on the other side. Of well, the it was snowing over there. Great design, Zach Taylor, Brian Callahan, always getting to come up with a start. There they toss it to Mixon. Gets a running start. A good yardage for 10. Another 10 foyer. They said, like, Joe Mixon had, like, a, a, a like one, like, 100-yard game, like, in the last however many weeks. Oh. I'm at gritty and in the snow. I'm hitting with the pump fake. They at gritty into the pump. Ooh, dog. That man, that that man had him. That man overthrew him. That man killing. <laughs> that man two runs. That man two runs with first downs. Like ten yards. Like <laughs> like that two runs is ten. He man got 10 yards and them two runs. And he's been struggling, they said. That's why and he was talking crazy, ain't gonna lie. That's why that's low-key why I'm ready to see the Bengals, man. I gotta see the Bengals. I gotta see the Bengals. Cause this man was talking crazy. We're the big dogs in the AFC. And then he said something else. That man said something else. That man was talking wild. I was like, whoa, you need to calm down. Y'all did y'all y'all made it to the Super Bowl last year. Y'all not just automatically the big dogs, you know what I'm saying? 
Like Kansas City been doing this for the last five years. To Higgins, nobody near him. And he knows where to go to get the first down. They have another one. Thought that was going to be so essential to his team. And you know what? Oh. To the end zone. Oh, play. Oh, he hit over another touchdown. And it, going into this game, I feel like the 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 question everybody was talking about is like, because I think Pat Mahomes is the best quarterback in the league. It was like Joe Burrow, Josh Allen, who's like, who's close, who's the closest to Mahomes? Me personally, I thought it was Joe Burrow because that man, he can make the same throws as Josh Allen, but he doesn't turn the ball over. Whereas Josh Allen... That man will, like, once he gets a couple completions, that man will start trying some things. And then, that's where he start getting the picks and the fumbles and all that. Yes, Josh Allen can run better than Joe Burrow, but Joe Burrow, he doesn't turn the ball over as much. So I always thought Joe Burrow was second. And he made the Super Bowl. Just off of accolades alone, that man went further. And he beat Mahomes in the playoffs. That man did something that Josh Allen ain't done. Complete for the first to Irwin. Dog, this look this look bad. The Bills ain't done nothing. It's Joe Burrow out here eating. That boy out here thriving. Oh, is sacked. It's Milano. He was actually start the second quarter. Man, Joe Burrow tried to hit him with a little spin move. Last play of the first. Fires it in there for a first down. Their first of the game. That's Diggs with the reception. There we go. Or rushing. Who cut that? Gabe. Boy, it's snowing. I can't. I wouldn't be. Well, I would not be able to play in no snow. I'm telling you right now, boy, my hands would be breaking. They throw the ball in my hand. My hands feel like they bleeding. Try to get warm. I can't. Like, it would be tough for me to play in some snow, man. I don't know how they do it. I feel like once you play in the cold, you can't get warm. Like your legs and stuff. It's hard to get. Oh, he he got folded. <laughs> Dog. Oh, the quarterback sneak. Josh Allen too big. He going to get them quarterback sneak. Oh, good catch. Oh, they finna score. Who came up last week. Fundamentals. Dog, it's snowing crazy. Oh. He's off with it, but he's not going to take off. Hold on a minute. Look at this effort. See, that's the thing that Josh Allen has over, like, Mahomes and Burrow, Herbert, all of them. The only person that I say could run, that runs as good as him, in my opinion, is Jalen Hurts. Like, as far, well, who runs similar to him that's still in the playoff. Because, of course, Lamar... Justin Fields, like they run, they're the best when it comes to quarterbacks that can run. Well, I'm talking about like that made the playoffs. Lamar didn't play in the playoffs, and Justin Fields, they got the work, they got the number one pick. But Jalen Hurts kind of runs like him. He doesn't trick people as much, but that man, he don't slide. <laughs> that man don't slide. I think I missed the Bengals touchdown That's with the button too. You know it's got to be true too. Second and six. It goes to first, and they'll mark him for the first down. It's game day, Joe. Though that's the different one. This is game day, Joe. On first down. My gosh! And the running the ball effect. You can't let them get first downs on the first run on first and ten. You can't let that happen. Second and ten. Right in the middle of the field. It's first. But got hit in the front flip. Okay. The tackle, but that's 19 more for the Bengals. Dog, they not playing at all. It's P. Ryan. And it everybody eating for the Bengals. Like literally, everybody's going crazy right there. Again, he got a good four or five yards before anyone put a hand on him, and a first down at the 20. Do this. We know what to do. Third and four. He does. Chase. It's man, Jamar Chase. Chase and Edmonds. And the pin down by Edmonds, but Chase. He's going to be able to make the nifty move. Hasn't shown a case of nerves very Third and go. Third and goal to the end zone. Oh, good kid. Touchdown. That's a good kid. Touchdown. That's a good kid. When it finally he gets to his back, isn't he, Gene? Right there. That's the toughest part. The receiver lost control of the ball. 
against Tennessee and Kansas City, the center of the Super Bowl. Yeah, 28 yard field goal. McPherson's kick is good. Right Hot down the middle. Complete for the first. You can't give that ball. If you're Buffalo down 10 and you have to punt that back, then you the extra two. Yeah, maybe you got to sneak preview or something later on. I don't know, but it's five in a row, which is a Bengal or Bills team record. Mm, good kids. That was a nice throw. Well, that was a beautiful throw. Oh, my goodness. There's your big game, Gabe, coming up with a big catch. We all know what they did. There's only been one 50 yard field goal plus in postseason history here. Third and ten. Allen and oh, they finna get him. Flag is out. It's gonna throw on the run toward the end zone and incomplete. This is your best chance right here. To get they didn't score. Off zone and get something down the field. Burrow flicks it. P Ryan with the first down. Boy, I thought this was gonna be a high-scoring game. Like literally, like when I seen it, I said, "Oh, this is gonna be a crazy like 35, 35, 38 type of game. Like something crazy like that." They're for real. Lou and Ruma, I'm so impressed with what they've done. I'm a believer. Callahan as well. And this is going to be Burrow taking off. Man, Joe Burrow moving. What the heck? That man moving fast. I ain't know Joe had that in him. Shoot, if Joe run like that, we might have to bring up that conversation. Who a better runner? That man, Joe Burrow moving fast. That boy, Joe Burrow low key low, got like hidden speed that he don't he ain't tapped into yet. One of these games, he gonna hit, he gonna break free for a crazy run. You don't ever see Joe Burrow run. That man will run out of bounds. One of these games, he gonna, that man gonna cut on the jets, and everybody gonna be confused. I'm telling you, cause that man was moving fast right there. Hard part's getting it off. They got away from the rush, and he's able to launch it deep. And Gabe Davis throw it out here. If not, trying to get Diggs and Paul. They three for twenty-seven in the first half. I ain't gonna lie, the Bengals. I thought this. Was, I didn't know who was gonna win. If I had to choose, I'd probably say the Bengals. But I thought it was gonna be a good game. I thought again. I thought it was gonna be high scoring. I thought the Bengal defense is locking up, <laughs> and and the Bills are at home, while the Bill defense is low key letting them go crazy. Like. There haven't been there haven't been many third downs that they haven't gotten so far. It looked like. See, look at this pressure. Oh, good pass though. Third and two. Dog, I missed that stat. You see, they're two and six. They average four and a half yards, so they should get it. But they're two and six on third down conversions this game. I'm telling you, this Bengal defense low-key playing. Like, they low-key playing great. But as a coach, I want to keep it simple. They're on the road against a top-five quarterback. Well, they're going to run it with him on third and two. And he stretches out the arm. In completion, second and ten. Now again. Look at the pressure that they're bringing on him. He making some plays. I'll give him that. But they making this man work for them. Has been tough of late. They go to him. Ooh. Oh, they did try to, and the pass is incomplete. Dax Hill with the excellent coverage. And the three makes it a 17 to right 10 game. down the middle. Oh, they started playing some <laughs> some beats. What's going on? Here's Burrow with Russo. Look at Joe. See, you see how Joe running there. He was running 10 times faster than that last one. I'm telling you, Joe got another gear he ain't tapped into yet. He's saving it. I think he's saving that. He will hit somebody with a, a long run. Them are going to be running hard, too. He makes something happen for 12 and a first down. Tracy down to you. And that, of course, was Michael Hyde's position at the start of the year before a neck injury for him. Now it's Jaquan Johnson in there. Shout out to Gaming Haven. <laughs> Hit me with the sub. I appreciate it. That was some fingertip grab by Higgins. Here's a third and ten. Had plenty of time. I man got number room. Oh, he hurdled him. When tight ends start hurdling, that's it's starting to get crazy. It's starting to get wild when the, when, when they when tight ends start hurdling people. What a play by Hayden Hurst. He went right over Jaquan Johnson who had come in for Marlowe. And the thing that's crazy is the only reason that that wide open is Burrow looking downfield creates more space for the receiver. Right it's Mixon 
Dang. See how he's running? That man going crazy. Nine yards in the first half. That's what happened to Mike McDaniel last week. He heard that it was the first down. Had to go back to the fourth and one. Third and one. Delay game. Toss it outside to Mixon. He's got it now, and he's in. See, look how big these runs are. That was some block. Boy, the building need Von Miller so bad, man. Von Miller changed this whole defense. I ain't gonna lie. This whole defense. And of course, they're missing people on defense. Like, people are hurt. They got a lot of injuries. Still waiting for a signal. No arms are raised. At the very end of it, you'll see Lawson come flying in. But Milano comes right there. And then there. Oh, that looks really close. That looks like a touchdown to me. Here, this is the view right there. They challenged it, and it's a challenge. I think they're going to win. I couldn't see anything. They have overturned the ruling on the field. It is a touchdown. Mixon broke the plane. And I think it's the correct call. He's been outstanding all year. He's been the they gave him a touchdown, so it's a touchdown. Ooh. That ball knocked out of the hands. Dang, you see how they did? Okay, look, at the, look at the defense, man. It's 24 to 10. Take it, the short route to Mixon, who high steps it to the fifty. This so man, Joe Burrow, that man don't get too high, too low. That man, he the he's like the the pure definition of even killed, and them the scariest type of people that just is just even killed. Don't get too high, don't get too low. They're just like I'm telling you, them even killed ones, man. They the most dangerous. It don't matter what's going on. They go. They can score four touchdowns. They're going to act like they haven't scored yet. Them even kill ones, I'm telling you. They don't get too cocky when they're in the lead. They continue to do what they've been doing all game. Look at all these first. They're going to be a field goal ring. I don't know. Here's the pass for Higgins, and it's incomplete. Oh, and the flag's out. Gosh, I can hear that hit up here. Oh. Pass interference. See what I mean? There's Mixon. Cam Lewis Ooh. able to make contact with him at the two. Trust this. I had to kick the field goal. From 20, that's all it is. And that kick is good. Right down right They middle. getting whooped, boy. Y'all know Bengals. Y'all know I want to see y'all. I've been saying I want to see. Oh, I can't wait. I can't wait to see Joe Burrow. Now, look, the only thing that makes me nervous is Pat Mahomes is hurt. The only thing that make me nervous, man. Well, there's something else that make me nervous. We'll talk about it at the end. Is this a catch made down the field by Dawson Knox? It's going to be hard because that defensive coordinator has done an outstanding job with pressures. Gets it away. And that catch right up the sticks. See, who are the D linemen? Who aren't? And who's coming? There you go. That's what you need to do. That's how you can win this. They down 17. 17. down and about five or six. Look at the demon. They keep holding. Go inside up here. One of those two. Run it. Still looking for answers. He should have ran. That man should have ran the ball. That man could have got the first. Look, that man was open. Look at this. Up here. One of those two. I would have taken off to the outside right here. I'll just truck my way to that first. <laughs> we we just gonna put it. I'm gonna put my. I'm going to put my head down. We're going to figure something out, boy. That defense playing, man. Bangle defense look elite, boy. Not only this time. I think Dallas can win this game, and I think they can win the Super Bowl. I also think San Francisco is as tough to play as anywhere else in the national football. Dog. See what I mean? Once again, just the effort. He literally just bullied his way to the first. have to have a quarterback but Just a, there, <laughs> like literally bullied him. In this game, does it? That stopped short, by the way, to be fourth down. They can beat anybody any day. They're not the underdogs anymore. There's a completion to Knox. Yeah, this game over. Two minutes to go. One minute. Yeah, this game over. Did they score again? He's going to be able to beat Patrick Mahomes. I can tell you right now, he's not going to have the same athleticism. He had. See, that's what make me nervous. The man Pat Mahomes got hurt. He turned his ankle. That's the only thing. That make me nervous. And then our defense isn't good, which is crazy because I had to argue. I'm arguing with my own like own Chiefs fans. They said the defense is not bad, but we're ranked 22nd in the league. I don't know what they – we're literally the bot, pretty much bottom 10 in the league in defense. I don't know what 
I don't know how that's good. I don't know how that's decent. We're 22nd. We're not even the teens. We're 20. Not even twin two zero, twenty two. There's thirty two teams. I think that he's not going to be near as athletic. Man. However, Mahomes on athletic is the best pocket passer in the NFL. Probably it's him and Burrow. Then there's an interception. Pick man, that's game. That's game. For Cincinnati, and this has been a great performance by the rookie. I mean, Tabor Britt's done it all. But they had like a perfect game on offense and defense right here. Josh Allen. It was like the perfect game. Joe Burrow have been the class for a while in the AFC. They're still there. It's going to take a lot to catch up with them. You saw Allen go over to Wilson. I'm telling you, this Joe Burrow, Joe Burrow better than Josh Allen, in my opinion. I know Bills fans don't want to hear it, don't like that. Josh Allen is not Joe Burrow or Pat Mahomes. That's it for the video. Make sure you like, comment, share, hit the subscribe button. I'll catch all y'all. I want to see Joe Burrow and the Bengals. I'm ready. Yeah, I'll see y'all next week. Yeah, revenge tour. I'll catch y'all next week. Till then, I'm out. Peace.